Hello and welcome back, beautiful collective. Thank you so much for coming to view, comment, like, subscribe. It's all deeply appreciated. Let's see what the universe has today. Let's see if any energies have changed for the collective energies. These soulmates in separation, what is currently going on? What does the universe want the collective to be aware of? Mm. Energies, please, for the collective concerning these soulmates in separation. Keep your dreams alive. Gratitude and appreciation. There's been a pause. Just maintain your childlike spirit. Contemplate the big picture. Crystal clear endeavor. Inner truths. Love does matter. Love does matter. Love matters. <laughs> Look at that. Love does matter, guys. It does matter. The soulmates in separation. What is the current energy? Relaxation. Things becoming pleasurable, simpler. You've been through a purification and you're about to see miracles. So just trust in these miracles. Because there is that voyage. Okay. Oh, wow. Huh. You're the stronger one. Look, I've never noticed this in this card. But it's almost like this great orca whale is guiding its young ones on their journey let's see what's going on for the beautiful collective what's going on self-acceptance you have a guardian angel around you or you were a guardian angel don't worry this is a learning experience Strength and guidance is here. Ask and ye shall receive. You've had to clear, cancel, and release this person to see clearly, to give you strength, to give you guidance. Whatever it seems that you ask for, you shall receive. Negative energy, keep it away. Honor your feelings. Hmm. Forgive. Go for it. Believe in your good luck. Step up and lead. So this person was supposed to step up and take a leadership role, but instead you did. But love does matter. So honor your feelings. Feel more. Feel deeply. Forgive. Go for it. Believe in your good luck. Hmm. Soulmates and separation, this collective energy. <laughs> Self acceptance, look at you. Nine of Pentacles. Self confident. What's this King of Swords doing here? Oh man, do they ever see your value? It's like someone might be coming in to chase you. Yeah. Hmm. Huh. Someone may want to, oh, a third party is keeping this person stuck. 
some kind of juggling situation. <laughs> Making a decision. Temperance is here. Okay, they're they're regretting their decision. You were their guardian angel. They regret not putting the work in. This king of wands spying on you. Some kind of burdened by some kind of message of love. Ooh. Damn, the star. So they're going to be hurt if you found new love. Oh my God. It's what they're hiding, that if they could turn things around, they would choose you. They would leave this karmic in the dust. <laughs> karmic might be holding children over their head. Self-sabotaging energy. Entrapment. Jealousy and envy. <laughs> Keeping this person. What? They're going to find out the truth. About a father? child's father they're going to end something ends in judgment ooh karma they know they want to apologize to you for making this decision somebody's trying to block your blessings Someone is trying to block your blessings, Collective. Now, I'm not going to put up with this crap. Yes, it is a magician and a magician's family. Uh-huh. Who is being a sneaky-ass sneak, sneak, sneak. Trying to block your blessings. Fighting and arguing. Trying to control. Planning to destroy. So they may have hang on. This person knows damn well that this karmic is just holding on to them for money. They know. Trying to control them into giving money some kind of tower with their wish fulfillment you're being blessed their person that's going to end with this other lover i'm telling you i don't care if they married them i do not care what this financial crap is all about don't care semper is waiting looking at some kind of Ghosting. Ooh. This person is going to stand up. Now, I know they broke your heart. I know that you've set up boundaries. What the hell is this? This little karmic is up to something here. This little karmic is going to end up heartbroken because this person's going to stand up for themselves. They are going to walk away. They want to return to their soulmate. 
or this person is waiting for you to return to them. Love does matter. So this was based on sexuality. It was based on finance. Sorry, guys. So this relationship with the karmic was based on financial codependency, based on what family thought, the karmic's family. Mm. Oh, oh, oh. But how does this person really, really feel? Why do they want to... Hmm. Well, now you're the golden coin here. You're the star. You are the guide. You are the queen of wands. You are the nine of pentacles. Who is the empress energy? This karmic is not even satisfied with this person. They're not even satisfied with this person. Your person is not satisfied with the karmic. Why did they commit to the karmic? See? They know what they've lost. They're focusing in on their work because they're trying to forget about you. If loving you is wrong, I don't want to be right. They know darn well that this is their true love. So that again comes out again. I have nightmares about what I did to you. I don't feel comfortable opening up. I miss the way we talked. I don't want to lose you, but I'm feeling trapped. No other has ever touched my heart the way you did, so love does matter. This person don't feel comfortable with their feelings. They pretended that they didn't care about you. I'm desperately longing for you, and I'm getting that in the energy. But they need more time, Spirit is saying. So, tell me about the karmic. You're being controlled. I said, tell me about the karmic. It's a controlling, obsessive, dangerous, karmic, unhealthy, possessive karmic. Talking shit. What's the truth? What's going on here? Fake flexing. That's what they're doing. Your person had a low IQ. Like, they weren't thinking. But that's crossing the reed. So that was the issue. They're easily taken advantage of or easily led, controlled by this karmic. And they're holding a grudge because your light is irritating their demons. See, they're wasting their time marrying for money, but that marriage is going to fail. This person is just talking shit, trying to talk shit about you. Ooh. So, I don't know if this person was just hustling them for money, but someone's getting photo evidence proof. See, they saw this person as money. Groupies, extra triggered, drama starters, stealing your ideas. They're getting bad karma, that's why. Bad karma. Ooh, they're impostering you. They're pretending they're you. So no doubt this karmic is pretending that they're you copying you whatever you say whatever you do that's why they're always spying on you guys to get info on you well spirit knows how to deal with people like that just clear counsel and release it all that's what spirit's saying just clear, cancel, release it all. If they want to be the foolish like that with their own lives, like I was saying yesterday, my spirit guides were getting fed up with these energies because spirits already warned them, already told them, 
you are rising whether they like it or not whatever they try to do against you this person still sees you as the the one the true love so they don't want to lose you they pretended they didn't care about you but they know you are their person so it's going to end up in heartbreak because this karmic is going to end up heartbroken by their own words their own fake flossing faking that they got some kind of uh look at me i'm a shiny toy look i got money i got coin here and they can't even pay for their trips they're broke and they're causing they're greedy it's like everything is for them me 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 i i i well how long does that last in any relationship i don't care if they married them or they didn't that's marrying for money and when the money runs out now what and it's looking like the money's gonna run out because this busy person is just busy focusing on work to keep their mind off of you but i think that this person's bad karma is losing some money because spirit knows that's exactly what the karmic wants so that's what i'm getting in today's read just start to feel more try to go in deeper and try to forgive just go for it just do it just try to forgive clear cancel release and let the universe handle it all it is a learning experience and it's part of a sacred plan so believe in your good luck you've stepped up you've led now miracle trust that miracles are going to happen just simply just relax enjoy the pleasures You've got the big picture. You see clearly what's going on. Expect your miracles. Inner truths are being really revealed. So you're making this person think. Whatever you're doing, just trust the universe. By clearing, canceling, and releasing this energy, it is causing them to think for themselves. And this karmic may try to control them and is controlling them, but love does matter. So, you know what I'm saying, let's just let the universe do their job. Because, quite honestly, they're not even thinking about the karmic. They're thinking of you. They need more time because they got themselves in a hot mess. It's what they got themselves into. Sorry, guys, but that's true. They got themselves into a hot mess. They don't even want to be there. They're faking. Everything is based on falsehood, uh, fakeness, pretense. And yes, love does matter, and they're going to figure it out. Love does matter. They know what they've lost, and they know they want your forgiveness. So they had low IQ easily taken advantage of but they're getting enlightened they're getting wisdom they're getting smarter they're taking risks spirit saying whenever this person was feeling lonely or feeling alone they would take a risk they would do something foolish so they're gonna learn spirit saying just send them healing energy and enjoy your life enjoy the ride enjoy the journey it's all part of learning 
this person is trying hard to keep their composure, but they are certainly struggling with it internally. Take care, beautiful collectives.